So let's go back in time. In 1984, there was a really cool hackathon. And at that hackathon, um, this famous phrase was coined by Stuart Brand, which is, information wants to be free. Well, it turns out his full quote was a little bit more complex than that, which was, information wants to be free. It also wants to be um, expensive, and there's a tension. And it uh, turns out it was a cool hackathon. Steve Bosniak was there. And I love his response, which was, information should be free, but your time should not be. And so this notion of time, I want to argue that there is a really, really uh, an opportunity to invest time and effort up front to allow for future options with your data by making the data shareable. And so this is really about this upfront time and effort in um, getting your data to that state. So what's different? Obviously, lots of things are different, but some of it is obvious to us. There is a lot more data. There is data abundance that is not only temporal in scale and scope. Uh, so what's the example of that? So today, if you looked at all the farming equipment that's in the US, and you'd be able to pull out all the data that's collected by the IoT in embedded in all this farming equipment, you could actually start getting real-time estimates of crop yields in the US. So you're going to start getting a sense of economic indicator that you couldn't otherwise get in real time. That's the temporal abundance. And then imagine what happens if you combine that data set with more traditional data set to get more interesting economic indicators. One other thing our labs work on is sort of getting better sense of the financial system through increasingly more available data. And of course, that's combined with the more compute power, the more uh, faster network. And as you can see here at Strata, there is increasingly better tools to ingest, store, enhance distributed data, better algorithm, and increasingly new applications like the one I just mentioned. So let's talk about what this means. So um, data has potentially more value when it can be shared. And in order to create that value, the data must be provided in a form that's shareable. And I'm going to talk about a few of the, basically, the principles we've put together uh, with the ODI on the notion of shareability. Um, so the one key point here, if you go back to Stuart Brand's tension between free and expensive, is that shareability is a quality that's independent of how you decide to license the data. And it's sort of this degree of the advanced preparation, that time, to make the data collectively more useful. 